Hello and welcome to Top Gear India. Now, as a sports bike owner or a performance bike owner, buying a new tire can be quite a tricky purchase. Uh, you only have so many options given the tire sizes that you have and uh, generally your options are limited to quite but a handful of tires. So the three most popular manufacturers for tires are Michelin, Pirelli and Mazzella. I'm talking about performance tires over here. And uh, these are your go-to options. But today we have a more homegrown brand that has uh, sort of come up with a new tire that can cater to these people and then the tire size. So I'm talking about TVS Eurogrip. Uh, now they are an in brand. Now they have built these tires in Madurai. They called it, they called the Roadhounds. And uh, I got myself a pair of these tires and we're yet to open them. And I just thought that we'd take this opportunity talk about these tires and talk about what we expect from them as we'll be testing these tires in a long-term report sort of thing and uh, we'll be using them on a street triple rs and uh, just finding out if they live up to the manufacturer's claims and how these stack up against similar tires in the same ballpark and the same price range so without further ado let me cut open this package and show you what the rubber inside looks like <laughs> Later. These tires have been designed in TVS Eurogrip's facility in Milan and they've been tested in the R&D facility in Madurai. So TVS claims that they have put this through a lot of meticulous and rigorous testing given that these are going to be on high performance motorcycles and they have, they're going to be under a lot, under a lot of pressure. So um, yeah, I, I honestly look forward to seeing what these tires have to offer, especially given that Eurogrip claims that they have actually put in a lot of effort to develop these tires. Now I'll tell you a bit more about the compound used in the tire. Alright, so I have a little brief over here from Eurogrip and uh, so TVS Eurogrip claims that uh, they have built this tire with a balanced mix of black carbon and silica. Now uh, the two tires, the rear and the front have different purposes and I'll tell you a bit more about the front. Now the front has been designed, it's all about grip, handling and responsiveness and the compound formulation used in the front has been done with keeping that in mind to enable those things. Now the rear is a bit more interesting on the other hand. Now the rear tire has been built with TVS Eurogrip's quadratic technology. So the quadratic technology is essentially where uh, the surface of the tire, it's been uh, sort of the compound used over there is to enhance braking and acceleration because when you're braking or accelerating, you're usually on the surface. Whereas the two shoulders on the outside have been given a softer compound so you have better grip when you're cornering. Now the original purpose for these tires were that they could perform really well in the dry and the wet. So almost uh, dual weather type tires, uh, the two kind of weathers that we really have in India for the longest, summers and uh, monsoons. and. Uh, the treads over here, as you can see, it has a lot of treads and a lot of grooves built into the tire and that's primarily for water siphoning. And uh, when they're not siphoning water, the rest of the tire and the rubber, the compound on it works well enough to give you as much mileage when you're riding straight, but when you're cornering to give you as much grip. Now, uh, these tires, there are some, I'm going to list down over here, a list of companies or manufacturers and their motorcycles that these tires are compatible with and here's the list so now you can have these tires with in either bias ply or in radial format if you wanted them so that they can suit a wider variety of tires. And uh, now the construction for these tires are essentially, uh, you've got high quality textile carcass with a zero degree steel belt and uh, TVS Eurogrip claims that this gives the tire a lot of strength, especially when it's pulling high speeds. So under those magnitudes of load, uh, the tire doesn't deform as easily and it helps to give you a more precise trajectory when uh, when it comes to handling. So now these tires have primarily been designed for naked bikes and touring bikes. Um, not exactly fully fared bikes, I mean you can use them on fully fared bikes but the reason why I say that is because TVS Eurocrit wanted to build a pair of tires that you can use for touring and you can use them as daily tires, you can drive them hard so when you go out for the weekend you can have a lot of fun because they've given you the soft compound on the sides uh, but when you're touring and you're just going to be riding straight for the most part, 
uh, the tires have enough mileage in them so that you don't have to swap tires. So for example, if you were using a pair of Pirellis, um, a pair of Super Corsas for example, you wouldn't be able to use those tires for any more than five to 6,000 kilometers. Uh, whereas these now, I don't know, but I guess we're gonna find out how long. I, I'm gonna go on a wild guess and say they should last at least 10,000. Uh, I'd be surprised if they did more, but uh, stick around for our reports on these tires. We're gonna be making more as the months progress now and uh, be putting miles on them to test them exactly in the dry weather and the wet weather. Right now we've got like a month of dry weather, so we're gonna make the most of it. And then once the monsoon rolls in, we'll tell you how these tires perform in the wet too. So as I mentioned before, these tires are not your all-out performance tires. They're more of a balanced usage. Uh, they're all, TVS Eurogrip also designed these tires with the fact in mind that a lot of these riders that will be going touring could potentially have luggage with them and a pillion. So these tires and their rigidity have factored those facts into. So keep in mind, these are primarily for touring. Don't go out there and put them on your Daytona and expect great increase in track times. Uh, there are other tires out there that are a bit more focused. Uh, these are a lot more for your naked and sport touring bike. So now I'm gonna tell you the prices of these tires. So the front tire, which is a size 120, uh, 17 inch, they will cost you about 13,000 rupees. And uh, now the rear tire, you can get them in two sizes. You can get a size 160, uh, which will cost you about 15,000 rupees. And you can get a size 180, which will cost you about 17,000 rupees. So what we have here is a 17 inch uh, 120 and 180, uh, front and rear respectively. And we're gonna be using them on a Street Triple RS, a 2018 Triumph Street Triple RS. So I'm quite excited to see what it's like on a bike like that because I've done a lot of touring on that motorcycle. I've done about 30,000 kilometers of just touring with that motorcycle and covered a lot of states. So, so on my Street Triple RS, I've used a pair of Metzler Rotec ones, which I used till they were done. And uh, I've also used a pair of Michelin Road 5s, which I've used quite recently. And I think I've done about 10,000 kilometers on them. And I was quite impressed with those tires. So that's what the benchmark is for me, the Michelin Road 5s. And uh, given the, their prices for these tires, they come pretty close to what the Road 5s offer. They are undercutting the Road 5s, uh, not by long shot, but they are undercutting them. So um, yeah, I will share uh, the prices down as you've probably already seen them. Stick around to the Top Care and YouTube channel. We'll tell you more about how these tires are faring. And we also have another pair of tires coming in a couple of days. Uh, that's gonna be for a, a dual sport bike. So stick around and uh, we'll tell you more about that.